Third time's the charm. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back. Today we are going to be doing a quick unboxing and overview of the Nespresso Vertoro Plus. A quick reason why I said third time's a charm is that this is my second Nespresso Plus within a week and my third Nespresso machine within two weeks. Uh, mostly just to do these comparison videos and to see which one is better uh, in my scenario. The first Plus model was perfectly fine. I got it on sale for around $150, but Costco was offering the deluxe version for $199. The deluxe comes with the Aerochino 3, which costs $100 on its own, and it came with two free coffee sleeves and a $40 off coupon that you can use at Nespresso's website or app. So even though it was a $50 increase, you do get $150 of items, which really makes it all worth it. I was actually going to keep the original Plus model and purchase the Aerochino 4 when I got the chance, but with that being $120 extra, with no major differences between the 3 and the 4, besides a handle and a spout, I figured it would be financially beneficial for me to just do the Deluxe Vertoro Plus box. Also this is the Aerochino 3, which I'll try to make a video for later. But to keep it simple, it's a milk frother that makes hot milk foam, hot milk, or even cold foam or cold froth. The Plus model does come with a bigger water container compared to the next, which is great, but still kind of weird that this model uh, doesn't have the availability to do carafes or use the craft pods that Nespresso offers versus the next. I do like the opening mechanism of the Vitero Plus. Do be aware when you first flick it open, it will begin to blink green. When it becomes a solid green circle, it is ready to brew. Just flick it one more time to open. But as you can see here, you don't have to wait until it's a solid green circle, but you won't be able to brew until it's solid. And depending on your cup, the Plus has you covered with its four different height levels from espresso to a regular eight ounce cup, it's got you covered. Even if you spill, which that stand can hold a decent amount, it's about an espresso's worth. And now I'll end this unboxing and overview of the Nespresso Vertoro Plus with the real world use of making an espresso. See you guys in the next one.